Hello, this is Roche Jana channel here. Um, I am starting a channel, as is what the CH means in my name, channel. But I am going to be uh, playing my favorite game of all time, probably. Uh, it is Fire Emblem Shadow Dragon, because I love Fire Emblem. And my favorite way to play it is Iron Manning, which is what I plan to do with these videos and i plan to stream i'm not going to be really making videos or scripted content i'm going to stream i am just making this first this first uh episode a a video just to test my new mic and stuff so i don't have to jump right into that um uh I'm not sure how well this is going to go. I've never done anything like this before. I mean, like, recording. I I know how to, like, play Fire Emblem and stuff. Um, but I'm just going to have fun. If you're expecting, like, a story-based playthrough, you will be disappointed. I'm sorry. I am skipping cutscenes. <laughs> and the hope is that this is going to be... A nice fun thing since I'm would just be playing this alone in my room anyway that I could maybe um, play it and have someone else watch it and be happy you know um, and I love this game and I was like well if I'm gonna do something like this I might as well start with with something that I'm gonna enjoy I'm just going to be doing the prologue in this video, and then I'll start streaming soon. Um, I'm going on out of town in, like, a couple days, so I poor timing, probably, but I'm not sure how consistent it's going to be. I have, I'm a student, I do things, yeah, my life isn't the most consistent. But I'll try to stream just whenever I would normally play Fire Emblem, which is usually pretty much almost every day. Um, also, I've played this game a few times before, and I don't like to do the same things over again for the most part. Oh, nice fun. Get to see that cool animation. Um, the animations in this game aren't the best, but I'm going to keep them on because it's Iron Man and that it proves suspense when you can watch your units die in front of you. Um... You also saw in the beginning that I am playing this on hard one. Um, I play games usually, I play them on the easiest difficulty, and then if I replay them, after I beat them, I play them on the next highest difficulty. But with Fire Emblem, since I Iron Man it all the time, I haven't, I've played every single game once. I've never beat, I've ne I haven't beaten all of them, but I have beaten Shadow Dragon um, once on an Iron Man playthrough. Um, I also beat it casually, and I also beat it in reverse recruitment casually, but, so this is going to be hard one, just because that's the next difficulty up that I have not yet beaten. Um, so we get Frey and Abel here. Um, somebody's gonna have to be, um, sacrificed at the end of this, and I'm going to make that decision when I come to it because I'm not sure what it's going to be myself to be honest. Um, Abel is one of my favorite units in the franchise. I love training him. He's just so fun to use in like every game. I love the Christmas Cavaliers. In this game, in every game, not every game actually, definitely not every game, but in most games I will usually train at least one of the Christmas Cavaliers so expect that um, I guess. <laughs> I'm probably going to train him, but I actually have some special plans for him using Shadow Dragon's very fun and very, <laughs> very hilarious uh, concept-wise uh, reclassing system. As for Frey, I've used him as a both a Paladin and a Draco, so I'm going to, if I do use him, which I might, I'm going to try to not use him on... In those classes because I, I want to see how he performs in other areas as well um, also I forgot to mention um, normally in hard I don't believe you get Frey I believe you get Norn 
if I'm not mistaken. But I like to play this game with the full content patch, and I forget who made it, but you can just look up uh, Fire Emblem Shadow Dragon full content patch, and it has a bunch of quality of life things, including all guidance. I don't have to kill people to unlock guidance, which is something that I like. It get, lets me experience the whole game without um, just, you know, taking huge risks. Like, I'm, I'm not going to kill half my roster to get Athena, but... I would like to use Athena, you know? And I have to be basically purposely trying to get Athena or playing on, like, a super hard difficulty I'm not ready for. In which case, Athena, you know, not going to help too much. So in order to have that full that fullness, I'm using the full content patch. It also includes some items that are not, that are, like, not ex available in the playthrough of the game. Uh, like the poleaxe and the like some brave weapons um, and stuff that are enemy only. Uh, eh, whatever. You'll crit totally. Dang. That's so unfortunate. Um, but also, I could very easily be playing this super, super uh, optimally. I could be playing every game. Um, with the whole thing of Draco Knights, I could reclass everyone everywhere to maximize growths. But I'm not going to do that, because that's not fun. Um, I'm going to play games how I think they are fun. And how I think this game is fun is just training random people and Iron Manning it, because that's what I enjoy. Um, so if you came here expecting super high-level content, go watch... There's, there are a bunch of people who do that. That's like all FE tubers really do for Shadow Dragon. Um, but go watch those. They're really good. Um, and then hopefully come back. I mean, I, I, I would appreciate that, but you know, you don't have to, I'm not doing this for any person in particular other than myself, to be honest. I'm just kind of here to uh, show you guys this great game that I enjoy a lot. Um, other units, I've already talked about Frey and Abel. Uh, Abel is one of the best units in this game, I feel like. Maybe not in, like, harder difficulties, but in straight Iron Man, he is one of the best early game units to just give experience to, and he will be good. Um, and he has, re he's really good, he's got really good ranks and really good weapons, and he's just always going to be a solid unit to give experience. You will never be disappointed if you train him. He won't, well, you... I guess you might if you get super screwed, but, like, then that's just, that's a skill issue, to be honest. Like, you should have just, you should have just leveled up more strength, I guess. I can't believe you just wouldn't do that. That's kind of stupid of you. Oh, no, Frey's at 2 HP. That, that, that would, that's such a shame. Um, but I do like taking risks. I love, how I, how I like playing Fire Emblem is Iron Manning it. That's how I just play things casually. I very rarely don't do that. Um, but, um, so this channel is almost entirely going to be of Iron Man's and slightly of, um, like, I, I just realized that I was accidentally clicked on into something on, <laughs> shoot, I accidentally clicked onto something on, um, OBS while I was... <laughs> Uh, doing the controls for my Nintendo PC. Um, that's <laughs> that's funny. Um, it didn't do anything, I think. I hope. Uh, speaking of, this is my first time using my very nice and cheap microphone. So, and I don't know how to do these things to the most part. I had some guides. By the way, thank you to a follow 8 for not only inspiring me to finally start streaming after thinking I might do it for a while, but like teaching me in Discord how to do things like make an overlay, which is what you can see here, as I'm going to be streaming where it currently has that uh, Fire Emblem logo up there above, above the bottom screen. That's going to be the chat. I just kind of put that graphic there because um, I didn't want to make a whole new overlay just for this video. Uh, <laughs> I'm sure you can understand that, uh, but I I just, I want to 
I want to share my Iron Man experiences. I've Iron Man every game at least once. By far, my least played game, however, is a uh, Radiant Dawn because I've only done that once, and I got to like chapter three, and Makaya got one shot. Uh, <laughs> but new units, um, Kane. Kane is just like Abel on. Fantastic units to use. I mean, he's the other Christmas cap. He's the other part of the other half of Abel's whole. Um, ooh, <laughs> uh, Abel is so funny. I, I love it, and I love the calves in this game. If you can't tell, but my favorite one is not one who has shown up yet. But you might have guessed because it's who my channel is named after. I I love Rochea, and if you had to ask why, I would not be able to give an answer. Because I don't know. I played it the first time casually, and I'm pretty sure I just let Roche die. I'm gonna be real. Sorry if I call him Rochea. I'm, that's just what I called him before the heroes. Uh, when he got put into heroes and got localized, because that's what, how I just saw that in vernacular. He said, "That's that's probably pronounced Rochea, right?" Um, but maybe my channel can be Rochea Jana, but the character is Roche. Um, and I just love him. I, I didn't use him at all first playthrough. Again, let him die. Um, I just, I just didn't reset. Oh my God. <laughs> These calves are really showing their affection for me after all I've treated them. I have actually beaten this game using only calves and not like reclassing them unless I had already trained them as a paladin, uh, like earlier this year. Or no, no, that was like December 2021 was when I finished that run just on my own. Um, I just wanted to do it and I wanted to see how they all turned out. And Mathis is still not good, <laughs> by the way. Um, but uh, I believe the only one I didn't use as calves were Abel and Harden because I had used them as calves before. But, oh shoot, saying. My computer just went into low battery mode, and I'm not sure why it isn't. Oh. Somewhere along the past few days, I accidentally kicked the, the little box thing, and I unplugged it on accident. So if the screen goes dark there, I'm not sure if we'll do that in uh, the recording. Uh, I don't know how this works, but... Um, that's because my computer went low power mode because I didn't notice that I kicked out a cord, apparently. But if, by the way, if we lose a unit in the pro... <laughs> Every time! It's all 3% crits, too. That's fantastic. Uh, ow, that hurts. Don't do that. If I use a unit in the prologue, by the way, I will, uh, I will eat my socks live on stream you will get a face reveal so that you may see me eat my socks because this will not happen ever mark my words dang it i hoped you would crit if i gave him 11 crit with the rapier that's so sad but new units i forgot to mention um well i was kind of going on kane but he my first playthrough killed medius and i used him <laughs> for whatever reason I decided to use him as a swordmaster, and that was so fun. Merbanon Swordmaster Kane. It was a trip. It was a, it was some kind of trip. Let me tell you. Um, this guy has low hit rate, and he still manages to bring Frey to two HP. That is annoying as hell. And now I have to use. A Silverlands probably use just to kill this guy so that he doesn't kill Frey. That sucks. Damn. Uh, right after saying that no unit will die, I might just lose Frey. Well, maybe I don't have to decide who no in the at the end of the prologue. Um. So you probably has have the best accuracy, right? Because iron bows are generally more accurate. Then uh, iron axis, and I forgot. I I'm usually gonna have a computer up here, uh, for 
checking stats and stuff so I don't have to go into another tab on my computer that I'm streaming on. Uh, but my sister is currently using it downstairs to do driver's ed because I live in a house with other people in it. Unfortunate. Unfortunate. Uh, by the way, if you hear noises in the background, if you hear people walking or you hear dogs because there are also dogs in here and they are big and they are indoor. Um, well, that's why. <laughs> that is why there are people. I'm just going to do a hit on this guy. Ah, Mel Kane might die, actually, if he gets hit by everything. I'm I'm kind of fine with Frey dying, you know? Because he's not the best. Cain and Abel are certainly di better than him. And there he goes. That's so tragic. Um, rest in peace, I suppose. Let me pull up his thing, because... I, if you see in the bottom left corner, there's that little, there's the graveyard, and oh boy, wonder what that's for, huh? Wonder what that could be. Wonder. Rest in peace, my lad. You will be missed somewhat. So now Cain get the fuck out of there. Um... That sucks. I'm really sorry, Frey fans. Um, I'm sorry, Frey. I'm sorry. Um, <laughs> that was not meant to happen in the way it did. He was not meant to be lost so prematurely. He was meant to be lost probably as a decoy, to be honest. Um, <laughs> but it's not all bad. We can, we, can, we can set up a kill for Abel here, which will always be nice. We will always take that. Um, but other units, Kane, I used as I've used as both a paladin and that all calves run. Um, oh, he only kills with the javelin. That kind of sucks. I I could have played around that better, I guess, because he could he could have missed with the javelin. Sorry for that little hiccup burp whatever that was there that made me stop talking for a second so awkwardly um but i promise that oh shoot i gotta eat my socks on stream now don't i oh damn that's <laughs> oh no why did i do that why did i promise this um yeah let's beat this guy for experience um Uh, maybe post things in the comments if you want me to use certain things or reclass in certain ways, because um, I have a few plans. Like I said, I have something planned with Abel. I have something planned with a couple other units. Um, but maybe, like, if you have an example, if you want me to use Kane in some way, maybe make him, like, I haven't actually used him as a Draco Knight, which is probably, which is easily his best class, actually. Um... But maybe you're like, oh, I want Kane to be a dude. What's in his What's in his reclass set? I forget what the reclass sets are for males. Shoot, the Cavalier one is Archer, Draco Knight upon promotion. Maybe you want me to be Mage. Maybe you want me to be Mage Kane. Um, I wouldn't recommend it. I also am doing some other mages reclassing, as you may. Uh, that's a little hint there. You'll have to figure out who. I'm sure some people know because I talked to them before streaming. Or they're the one who gave me the idea. Um, I follow. <laughs> uh, go watch a follow eight streams. I'll link them in the description. If I don't remember to, then fuck me, I guess. But uh, he's a cool guy who really helped me start streaming and really just helped me in general. And he deserves a little more. He deserves a little more. He also does a lot of he does a lot of Fire Emblem ROM hacking things. So if you if you like that, he's your guy. He has everything you everything you need. Um, let's just have Abel wait there. Nothing could go wrong. There's nothing that could go wrong. But um, I know the I know the animations are ugly, but yeah. 
Another unit you've probably been interested in is this funky looking guy. He looks a little different. Jagan. Uh, this old man, this old fuck. He... Sorry for cursing, by the way, if that... Maybe I'll put something in the description about that, but... I'm a kind of vulgar person. Not really vulgar. I think, like... Not more vulgar than the people, like, at school or anything. Uh, but, like, people say I am when they aren't, like, from my area. Maybe my area is just super vulgar. Um, <laughs> it's kind of, I don't know, but I do tend to cuss a lot. If that bothers you, I'm sorry. Um, but... It's just kind of how I speak. So, yeah. Um, but Gor Jagan, why did I call him Gordon? That's not a unit that exists ever. Um, <laughs> I tried using Gordon once, by the way. And I arena grinded him to 2020. And he was still worse than just like a regularly trained Roche. Guys, Roche is actually good, in case you can't tell. Um, I've used him a lot. He's so fun to use. And I never actually kind of went into it. I'm really scatterbrained. I'm sorry. ADHD out the wazoo. Uh, that's not something I usually say. Please don't unsubscribe. Uh, please don't, please just, just don't click off just for me saying that. Uh, <laughs> but it very mentally ill, very scatterbrained at times. My commentary's very hard to follow. It's because I'm probably not presently in my brain. Um, one thing I've noticed, because I've never actually played the prologue on hard difficulty before, but I didn't know there were hand axes. I didn't know the prologue was even affected by difficulty change, to be honest, either. Um, it seems that's, 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 that's interesting. That I'm, I'm actually blaming that on Frey's death, Frey's premature death. But, you know... Sometimes, sometimes people die. It's, it's an Iron Man, all's fair in love, war, and pain, and also fire emblem, and truly everything is fair in a fire emblem because Marth commits so many war crimes with child soldiers. One of those child soldiers actually managing to be himself, which is, a, I think, a new feat. That should be like the new bar for... Um, war criminals in the future right is if you're gonna be a war criminal the like new standard is that you yourself have to be part of the war crime you know if if you're employing child soldiers and you aren't yourself a child soldier i think that means that you, you're not even like there you know you aren't even up to par like look at look at marth out here who's on such next level war crimes that he's managing to not only commit them, but become them. Um, so Martha's actually a Sigma male. <laughs> but unit reviews, I should probably get going on those since I keep getting sidetracked. And also how I use Roshea, but I don't know. I just, I soloed FE3 book one with him when I played it casually, which I started playing casually because I was Iron Manning it. And then I lost the Iron Man, but I was like, damn, this game too fun because I really like the Arcanea games for whatever reason. They really attract me. What is, why can't I? Okay. For whatever reason, I just couldn't control uh, Shadow Dragon for a second there. That's kind of worrying. But we're going to kill this archer. Just kidding. Um, I almost just accidentally didn't. Just kidding. <laughs> I, um, he's really bad. But he's, you know, fresh meat, and it's not like we can make him a decoy anymore since Frey died, but I'm, like, kinda sure that, like, well, he's he could be a good meme unit, that's what we'll say, he's a meme unit. Uh, he's not good, he's really not good, he will never be good. Maybe I could find a different classroom, because when I did train him, I just made him an archer. Oh, what was that? I'm not sure if that carried on to streaming or recording. It probably did. Wait, do I still have to make a decoy? 
Do we? But someone died. I thought you didn't have to. Huh. Well. I don't know about you guys. But there's like. An option. Right? Like. We could do that. We could like. We could like. We could forget we ever recruited him. There didn't need to be him. It's like he never existed? Did he really die if he died serving his country? I'm of course referring to Kane. We are going to be sacrificing Kane. I think the meme tier is too funny. Too haha comedy. To not do. Um, what? This is an Iron Man run. How could you be doing this? How could you be sacrificing Kane, who you were just talking and saying so many praises for? For a unit... Well, you have a unit that's so poised to be sacrificed, like a, like a lamb, like a, an absolute, like... Just, he's, he's a scrub! How, you even said you used him. You arena grinded him the 2020. And he was useless. Why would you use him? You're on a harder difficulty, you know. Things like that just don't, don't just fly. You need good units. And to that, I say we do need good units. But why did it. Oh. So apparently, I can't type. <laughs> when I type, it uh, pauses. Says Mume. There we go. What? Oh, there we go. All right. Um. Yeah, I'm. I'm sacrificing Kane. I, I ruined the bit by not knowing that Desmond Me did that with OBS. That's so sad. But I'm sorry, Kane. I love you. You're an amazing unit. You're so fun to use. Murmured on Kane, which would have been very fun to recreate in this run. But he's too funny. He's the five points man. How could you not like him? Um, Let's just advance with Abel and uh, Jagan. Do we just want this guy gone? Like, I think we just want this guy gone. Out. No more. Be gone. Um. So I never even finished talking about Kane, <laughs> actually. But he's just he's just a good unit. He's a man with good stats. Uh, he's just good. A lot. I've heard some people say that he's not good. But like, he's a good candidate for just experience. That's it. That's all I have to say about him. I like using him. He's fun. All these units, to, I'd say like, all the units we have right now are like, good. Like, Marth is pretty good. Uh, he's got the rapier, which... Effective weapon is so important, so important in this game, um, which I I like that about a game where effective weaponry is important. Um, Frey was like a very middle of the road unit. Gordon sucks. I say as he kills a man, but you know, uh, if you've ever played this game, you know Gordon is awful. Um, but pretty much all the rest are like. Jagan is A to S tier. You can argue. If you don't know what I'm talking about with tiers, watch like any tier list video on YouTube. They're everywhere. I'm just, if you haven't, I'm not sure how you found my video, considering this is my first video on the channel, which means YouTube does not favor it, and you haven't somehow heard of a tier list before. I just want this guy gone. I don't care. EXP thief. Whoa. Um, but Jagan's great. Being promoted just means he reclasses to Draco Knight or Bishop or something, and he does shit. And he's got 
Silver Lance. Um, that's pretty much it. Um, Captain! Oh, Captain, my Captain. Um, what's in this village? Is it worth it? Hmm. I would definitely have this on my other computer if I had it. What if I just grabbed my phone? It's like right over there. Nah. Just to not be on it. Or we could use the pegs for experience. Um, sure, why not? I could use it. Maybe we do use Gordon after all. Um, I'm definitely going to regret sacking Kane, aren't I? Well, to be honest, I was going to probably going to uh, sack uh, Frey just because he's kind of the least interesting of the units, you know? But, like, kind of died. Very tragic. Um... So that was, that was not a good endeavor, I suppose. But hey, experience. This guy isn't gonna just kill Gordon. Okay, good. <laughs> um, this could be a kill for Mar. I guess we want. Do we want that kill on Marth, or do we want it on Abel? I think we want it on Abel. Actually. Because we could also give it to Gordon, but no, I'm just not, no. Um, so rest in peace, Kane and Frey. Very fun units. Um, very sorry Kane had to go. And I'm extremely sorry to Frey, who... Wow, in the prologue, in the prologue. Um, so this guy, I thought that guy had crit on Morth for a second. I was like, wow, that's just kind of just sad. It's unfair. To be perfectly honest. Um, but at the end of the day, I'm gonna use Abel. And I don't, I'm probably not gonna use Gordon. Why did I keep him alive over Kane? Because I probably wasn't gonna use Kane either. And even though Kane is better if people die, which is all too possible, um, I. He's funny. It's the funny man. You say the five points, and look at this. He even do <laughs> three damage. <laughs> look at that boss XP. That's so crazy. Um, <laughs> <he's> <laughs> whatever, whatever. Um, and I'm not... If, if Marth dies, if the run ends... I'm just not going to reset. We're going to go on to the next game. Um, so this channel is mostly going to be entirely Fire Emblem Iron Man. Every once in a while, I'll probably do like a Pokemon Nuzlocke, because that's in a similar vein. Not near as familiar with those. Um, but, you know, they're Pokemon Nuzlocke. I like Pokemon. I know Pokemon. I've done a couple of them before. Um, I've never beaten any, but I got Fire Red to like the Elite Four. Um, I also tried to play some games like Tactics Ogre, maybe? Maybe, like, Valkyria Chronicles or XCOM or some other game like that. Maybe someday I'll stream... I, I like playing fire, uh, fighting games. Um, I'm not good at them, except for exactly Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. Because I have an unhealthy obsession with that game, which is one of the main reasons why they diagnosed me with ADHD and other things but just because of how crazy that obsession is how much i played it but not like in a an obsessive way i guess it's just kind of like a i play it whenever i'm bored that's just the thing i do but now i have so many hours that it's crazy and you know um maybe some the point is maybe someday i'll stream fire uh sh or <laughs> i'll stream fire emblem shadow smash bros 
Um, if I can figure out how, I'm not sure how you do it with the Switch. I don't have the equipment for it, but maybe someday. Um, probably should do it before I get to streaming Three Houses, Three Houses, because I do also play the Iron Man that game, and also Three Hopes, Three Hopes, you know, and Warriors, because I have the Switch version of Warriors and not any other version. But this is the prologue. This is episode one. If you enjoy the channel, please stick forward to all the other streams, which will be different, of course, because they will be of different. Um, they will be not. They will be live. They will be live, which I'm not really editing this at all. This footage, probably, because I don't know how, and you know. It's more realistic if I do it this way, because this is what the rest of my streams are going to be. Because it's not like I can edit things while I'm doing them. But show up if you can. Um, or if you like it, you know. Yeah. Um, Fire Emblem Shadow Dragon, this is the prologue. Someday, maybe also, I forgot to mention with fighting games, sorry. That was definitely an outro, but like, jut jutting in to say that the fighting game tangent was to say that I might stream like some Steam fighting games like Street Fighter, or Guilty Gear, or something. Maybe. Maybe. Subscribe.